Welcome back to Quick Tips. I'm Caleb Thompson with Off-Road Addiction TV and this week's Quick Tip we're talking about essential recovery gear to carry in the back of your vehicle. But first, do you have your Off-Road Addiction hoodie yet? And if you don't, why not? Let us know below. We've got some new ones coming soon. Anyways, let's get into it. First, we've got our tree trunk protector. Now, if you've got a winch, you're going to need a tree trunk protector. This is a six meter because we can also use this off-road for towing a vehicle if we need to line tow them somewhere. Now we've got the essential when you're a beginner, a snatch strap. As you can tell it's brand new, we don't use it anymore. Reason being we have a winch and once you have a winch it's just easier and safer, much more controllable to winch. Now if you do have a winch you want to get yourself a pulley block. These things are fantastic and an essential piece to carry in the back to get yourself out of a tricky situation. Now of course once you've got all this gear, you need to attach it somehow. So we get ourselves a rated bow shackle, which I no longer use because I've replaced with the soft shackle made out of Dyneema winch rope. And these things are fantastic. As you can see, this one is much loved and I'm about to make some new ones. Now, the other thing I wanted to talk about is people bringing ratchet straps out to do recoveries. Don't. There's no stretch in it. So basically, what a snatch strop is designed to do is to stretch 20%. They call it 20% elongation. Now, that is so it stretches and it takes a little bit of the load out of the strop. Whereas if you did it with this, it's gonna go bang. Not nice and can potentially rip your bull bar or your recovery points clean off your vehicle, even if they are well secured. Now, the other thing that is not essential, but it is very, very crucial to have, especially if you're going off-road, then jumping back on the road, is a tire deflation system or inflation system. We use the Indeflate. It does both, two tires at a time. Thank you for watching this week's quick tip. I hope this very, very quick and basic tip helps you out a little bit when you go shopping next to get some recovery gear for your four-wheel drive.